Developing story overnight, SWAT teams and police helicopters descending upon a neighborhood right outside of Sacramento for a tense standoff. This whole thing started when four law enforcement officers, including a federal agent, were allegedly shot by a parolee caught up in a gang sweep. And ABC's Aditi Roy has been covering this all night from our L.A. Bureau. Aditi, good morning. Good morning, Dan. The pictures you're about to see are incredibly dramatic. It was a night of terror for neighbors as gunshots went flying between the suspect and officers. This morning, this small California community is reeling from an overnight gun battle that has left four cops hospitalized, including a federal agent. According to Roseville Police, the shooting began at 3 p.m. when an Immigration and Customs Enforcement agent was working with local cops to track down 32-year-old parolee Samuel Duran. Police say Duran, armed with an assault rifle, opened fire, hitting the ICE agent. I'll tell you what. We have a great community of law enforcement that's going to deal with this. Duran ran to a relative's home where police say another barrage of gunfire took down three more officers. The other officer was consulting the other one by rubbing his back. It happened so fast, it, he jumped the fence and then now this massive hunt was is here. Duran escaped once again, eventually barricading himself inside this vacant home before finally surrendering, ending the nine and a half hour night of terror for these residents. It's a very tough day. Uh, it's, I, it's it's unsettling thing for all of us. Uh, no one's immune to this sort of tragedy and this sort of uh, criminality. The suspect was taken to the local hospital for routine medical clearance. He's in the process of being booked and then taken to jail. Biana, some incredibly tense moments for hours on end. That's right. As you said, a night of terror for the people in Sacramento. Aditi, thank you.